of all the guys you faced, if you could get back in the cage one more time, uh, on the guarantee that no injuries, everything's good, you face one guy one more time, who would it be? Well, I know for a fact I can wipe the floor with George Shakespeare. Yeah. I know for a fact, so I'd like to do that one again. Okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, I tore, I broke my ribs a week before that fight. Right. It's all in the book, you know. Yeah. Uh, so I didn't break them, I tore the cartilage. I couldn't move very well. And then there's a thing in the book where I was going to, I sneaked in and inject uh, a needle full of lidocaine, and I was going to, in the toilets, inject myself with lidocaine into the rib, mm. which would numb the rib so I wouldn't have the pain. Right. Because uh, it's not a banned substance on USADA. So I could have gone to the commission and said, hey, uh, I want to inject myself with lidocaine. That wouldn't have been the issue, but the fact I had an injury, they might have pulled me from the fight. Gotcha. So, but then the doctor said, you've got to be careful, because if you inject yourself with lidocaine in your rib, if you get it slightly wrong, you can puncture your lung and yeah, die, help, yeah. right? So I, I was, so I had it all in the bag, and I was going to FaceTime my doctor on the toilet while the commission members are outside, and he was going to talk me through injecting myself with lidocaine. That's and when insane. I got there, I'm like, this is too much bollocks to it, so I just went out there and fought injured, you know, and I, I, everyone was like, you, you weren't moving too well. I'm like, yeah, no shit. My ribs were seriously messed up. Oh. But anyway, there you go, George Shakespeare.